back to another episode of Ballin' With, guys. We're still going down the list of teams here. Uh, Tennessee Titans are second to last on the list of, of NFL teams. We've been going over all the NFL teams, over or under for the season. Total wins listed by FanDuel Sportsbook, and they have the Tennessee Titans listed at seven and a half wins. Guys, let's take a dive into their schedule. Are they going to get seven and a half wins this season? Um, they could. They could. I think they could win eight. They're not going to win the division, um, and I'm just saying eight because that's over the top of the prop bet. But um, they have a good team. Derrick Henry, DeAndre Hopkins, um, Trey Burts, they have other running backs. It's the quarterback carousel that's going to go on. Is Tannehill going to be healthy? Is Malik Willis going to be able to produce? Is Will Levis going to be able to produce? And is that quarterback drama going to be controversial to the team? That's what we're going to figure out. Um, but their defense is pretty stout. They are a smack mouth football team. Mike Rabel is a good coach. Um, I see them winning about eight to nine games. That seven win mark will be on the lower end, but uh, I can see the Tennessee Titans doing subpar, uh, at least, you know, competing out there. Uh, I do think they're going to lose week one versus this uh, New Orleans Saints. The Saints are just a better team to me. They have a better overall. Michael Thomas is back. I think he uh, does a great week one as well with their car, and then we just moving the ball downfield with Chris Olave as well. Uh, I think they come 0-2 versus the Chargers. Uh, they can beat the Browns. They can be a smack mouth football game right here. And then, like I said, depending what Titans we're going to get. We're getting the gritty Titans from the past couple of years. I can see them beating the Browns here. I can see them losing versus the Bengals and becoming 1-3. and three. They just have a tough start. Um, the Saints, these are all might be contend, potentially playoff teams, their first four games. Um, I got them going one and three here. I got them beating the Colts here, two and three. I got them losing versus the Ravens, two and four, beating the Falcons, three and four. I do have them losing versus the Steelers here, three and five, win, four and five, four and six, five and six versus the Panthers, six and six. They're gonna sweep the uh, Indianapolis Colts, I think. They're going to lose to the Dolphins 6 and 7. They're going to beat the Houston Texans. I think they're going to sweep the Texans and become 7 and 7 right here. Uh, like I said, they're going to be on, you know, 500 probably the rest the whole season, really. Uh, I think they lose to the Seahawks 7 and 8, 8 and 8 right here. Uh, and then they're going to lose to the Jags. That um, I think the Jags will be a, a couple games ahead of them, though. But this will just be for their uh, spirit. Jazz might be rushing players. Titans are going to be competing to win this game, to win that ninth, eighth game. And they Titans can win. They're going to be in the wild card. Potentially, they have an opportunity. So everyone will count, uh, especially towards the end. I think they will win this game and be 9-8. Nine 9-8. and 9-8 eight. Nine and eight. Nine and eight is not bad. I think that trumps over two games over that. Uh, I can see the Titans win it. If they play well, it depends how that the carousel plays out with be drama with the team, with everything, uh, and will that affect them? Will Ryan Tannehill not be there with, with Malik Willis and Will Levis at the QB helm? Will that affect offensive um, performance? So those are all questions to look out for. But if they're coming out from the past couple of seasons smacking mouth football, I can see them winning eight to nine games. So I got them going over. Eight and a half games, seven and a half games, guys. They're going to win eight to nine games. Uh, with that being said, guys, make sure you comment, like, subscribe. Uh, Tennessee Titans is locked and loaded. Mail that to your nearest bookie. Um, we will be doing high school highlights this upcoming fall and winter seasons uh, for basketball and football. Going to be premier uh, most of the um, – Premier matchup games in the, in the area, private school, public schools. The records are showing that you're good. We're going to come to those games. And we're just trying to uh, put the athletes on as well around the area. But, guys, again, make sure you comment, like, and subscribe to see that, to see that journey and to see more uh, highlights, news, media, sports bets, and uh, sports challenges on the channel as well. Guys, signing out. See you guys on the next episode.